What's going on, ballers? Thanks so much for tuning in again, and welcome back to another Big J Basketball box break video. Today, we are going to be reviewing a Panini Kids Crate 2021 Series 3, and this box is enormous. It like barely fits in the in the screen right here. Um, so let's take a look at what we can get out of our Panini Kids Crate. So there's going to be cereal boxes of Prism Baseball 2021 Chronicles Draft Picks Basketball. And what I'm more excited about is the Cereal Box of 2021 Chronicles and Cereal Box of 2021 Mosaic. Um, so let's open this up. This box is enormous. I gotta open this up and take this stuff out and we'll uh, see if we can get out of here. It's actually, it's sealed on the bottom here. So we'll cut this open and take a look inside. So we've got... Uh, couple little extra things in addition to the card so let's pull let's pull this extra stuff out so there's like some stickers select like panini select basketball so there's a little sticker for that rated rookie sticker so again this stuff is definitely meant more towards kids and before people get mad at me saying hey you bought a kids crate product and these are supposed to be for kids in the hobby these have been sitting on panini's website for who knows how long and i waited and waited and said you know what if they're not selling out I'll go ahead and buy one and try it out. So we got our stickers there. Got a little, um, this looks like a basketball. It's almost like a stress ball kind of thing, I think, or maybe a little basketball to play with. It also comes with a pen. Who do you collect? And a water bottle. So we got some extra things to go along with the cards, but obviously what I'm more interested in is the cards since we're gonna open these up on the channel. So these are called cereal boxes. They're basically this shape and size of like those kind of one serving cereal boxes that you can buy. So we got Prism Baseball, um, Chronicles Draft Picks. Not super excited about either of these. Definitely more excited for these. Um, Chronicles and Mosaic. So these Mosaic cereal boxes are still selling for like $50 plus on eBay. This entire kid's crate with four boxes and all this extra stuff was only $70. So basically you're paying for the mosaic box and a little bit extra and you're getting all this extra stuff as well. So let's go ahead and get this out of the way here. Um, if you haven't subscribed to the channel yet, go ahead and hit the subscribe button. Click that bell for notifications so you get notified whenever we post new stuff pretty much all the time. Um, uh, here's our four boxes that we're going to rip open today. Um, so that, like I said, the baseball, the draft, and then the two in the middle are the one I'm more excited about. So we'll start off with the baseball and the, uh, actually I should reverse these. We got uh, Ant-Man Chronicles in the back. So we put our Chronicles box here and then we got our Lamello with our Mosaic. And we'll go ahead and start off with these two to see what we can get. Um, you'll see I refreshed the background here to finally get some uh, more uh, more recent boxes that we ripped all 21 22 stuff and i hope the video looks okay i recently upgraded uh my camera so you'll notice some smaller changes in addition to the background the uh the app i used to use for my uh thumbnails uh was no longer uh in the app store so i wasn't able to get that on the on my new phone um so i had to try out some uh some different things for the uh thumbnails and then um different camera for the video as well. So we'll see how this turns out. Looks pretty good from what I can tell. Hopefully it looks good once I upload it to YouTube. Let's do baseball first. Um, not a huge baseball fan. I guess what we're looking for here, Black Velocity. Oh, Black Velocity prism number to one. So you can get a, you can get one of ones out of here. Wow. All right, a lot of stuff. So wow, if we could pull a one of one, that'd be pretty awesome. Even though I know unlicensed baseball stuff is not, uh, you know, typically the most uh, sought after, but that's okay. So I don't know if there's any black velocity one of ones. Oh, I didn't even look. We can get, okay, so there's going to be two, three blue velocity and two red velocity parallels per box on average. So that's probably what we can expect. Uh, maybe we'll get something extra, one of those numbered cards. All right, so this looks pretty much just like uh, 2020, 21. Uh, prison basketball. So there's Daniel Lynch. You know, I, I'm not going to recognize probably a lot of these guys. You know, a lot of rookie logos up here. I don't really know who these guys are. Not, I don't. Jack Morris, I know him. He used to play for the Twins years ago. There's Ronald Acuna. I know he's a big name player. 
and we can get a nice parallel of him. So let's get to our parallels. There's a insert of illumination, Trey Turner, Christian Javier. So here, ooh, is that a black? Wait, wait a second. Black velocity number to one. That looks like a black velocity to me. I don't know about you guys. <laughs> <laughs> Let's save that one for the end, and we'll look at our other ones first. There's a rookie. I'm assuming these red velocities are probably not numbered. Nope, they are not. Cal Ripken, old school. Don't know who this is. Willie, I don't know who that is. Ricky Henderson, I know him. Played a long time ago. Will Myers, Jake Harrietta. Pete Alonzo, I've heard of him before. And Juan Soto, I definitely know Juan Soto. Okay, so there's, that's what we got so far. But if I'm not mistaken, this could be a one of one here. Let's um, see what we got. Oh, I <laughs> think I, I might have spoiled it. And it's a, it's a Robin Yunt. I definitely know him. Is this really numbered one to one, one of one? Holy crap. <laughs> this is only the second one of one I've ever pulled on the channel. And it's a Robin Yunt Prism Baseball Black Velocity. Hey, but one of one for a Hall of Fame baseball player, unlicensed or not, I will definitely take that. There's got to be some Robin Yunt collectors out there that might want to collect this. And this actually looks really centered really well. Um, not sure if it's worth grading. I don't know. We'll see. Okay, well, that was, I was not expecting that to hit a one of one out of Prism Baseball. But hey, I'll take it. All right, zero box number two. Let's do uh, Chronicles draft picks now. So again, I opened a lot of this product when it first came out. Um, this is, I, I think this might be the only format I haven't opened yet for this product. I uh, didn't even look at the box to see what we can pull. So we're looking for seven Pulsar parallels. Um, is there anything else we can pull out of here? So there are some numbered cards. Um, select base pulsar score number from 149 to one. So we can pull one of ones out of here too. So let's uh, let's go two for two and let's pull another one of one out of uh, out of this box. So we got Jalen Suggs, Kaminga. So you guys have seen all this stuff before. There is Io, Desunmu. That'll be flipping all the time. Keon Johnson, Corey Kispert, Davion Mitchell. So I think we got our, oh, there's a lot of Pulsars in here. Daron Sharp. So much flipping on these. I think I saw a pretty good player at least. Bassey, Moody, and there's our first Pulsar, and that's going to be Evan Mobley. And it's, it's kind of interesting seeing a Pulsar on a paper card. This isn't, usually Pulsars are on um, the like chrome cards, um, but it's kind of cool seeing a Pulsar pattern on a paper card. That was really nice. Definitely nice hit there. Oh, Mobley, Jalen Green, another good one. Zaire Williams played pretty well in the playoffs for the Grizzlies. Joel Ayayi. We got, okay, so there's, I guess there's paper, there's paper Pulsars at the beginning and maybe some chrome Pulsars maybe later on. Let's see. Got Jaden Springer. Kate, oh, there's a Kate Cunningham. Very nice. I'm not sure what I'm doing with my piles here. They're going to be all over the place. Cam Thomas. There's another one of the Pulsars. There's a Jalen Suggs Pulsar. Okay, so we got some paper Pulsars, some hollow Pulsars, and then I guess Chrome, pul chrome Pulsar at the end. Zaire Williams again. Corey Kispert. I see these are the score exclusive, so eh, no numbered cards. On the scores, unless this one is. Nope. Kai Jones. And here is a Chrome Pulsar. That's going to be Greg Brown from Mosaic. And then on Flux, that's just a base going to be Trey Man. Okay. Kind of interesting to see. Let's go ahead and didn't pull off the, uh, strip off the plastic on our Chronicles and Mosaic. Mosaic, obviously, the one I'm most excited to rip, so we'll do that one last. Okay, let's do Chronicles now. Haven't seen a whole lot of these open. I think uh, Capital P cards ripped a few of these not too long ago, and he pulled some nice stuff. But other than that, I don't think I've really seen a whole lot of these 
Chronicle cereal boxes rip. But have ripped a lot of Chronicles on the channel, so a lot of this is going to be stuff we've seen before. But let's see what the exclusives are out of here. So base totally certified rookies is the exclusive on Chronicles. So here's what we can pull out of here if anybody wants to pause that. So totally certified rookies. There's numbered cards, blue, purple, gold, black, 99 all the way down to one. So again, we can, you can pull one of ones out of here, which is kind of crazy that you can actually pull one of ones out of this stuff. And here is our Chronicles. We got Obi, we got Zach, got Wiseman, we got Donovan Mitchell behind the Wiseman, Tail Maladon, Jokic, Denny Avdia, Russ, RJ Hampton, Kyra Lewis, Sadiq Bey, Akundo Campazo, Ben Simmons, everybody's favorite. There's another Teo Maladon. John Morant, it's going to be a Ja second year card. And the base Panini Ja from last, the year before, this is the one we won. That one is still going for a ton of money. Haven't seen any totally certified yet. Sadiq Bey, there we go. We got an Ant Man XR. Throw this in our notables. It's another Avdia. Quickly behind him. Tatum. Huge game seven from Tatum to take down the Bucks the other day. Campazzo again and Wiseman. Where are all the totally certified? <laughs> all right, we got a Maxi. Honors. Really nice looking card. Oh, I guess the two at the end are the totally certified. And they, I think they're both just the base. So no numbered cards here, it looks like. But there's a Maxi. There's an Obi Toppin. And there's Onyeko Congo. So these are our two exclusives from the cereal boxes there we go and last box mosaic this feels kind of heavy i guess it's the cards are heavier than uh, the chrome cards are heavier than the paper cards but if anybody wants to pause that here's what we can pull out of here the most interesting thing i think about this is stained glass straight fire more so hobby exclusive rare inserts are actually in these cereal boxes i haven't seen any actually pulled uh, yet, but that's what I'm hoping we can get. Six presents per box on average. I think the um, reactive greens, I think, are the most rare. There should be only one of those in here. Reactive red should probably be most of the other six prisms in here. But what I would love to see is a ultra rare insert. If I could, I'm still trying to put that stained glass set together. So if I can pull a stained glass card with someone that I need for the set, that would be incredible. Not banking on it, but you never know. All right, here's our last pack. All right, I don't want to peek ahead. We're just going to kind of do a no peek here. Probably going to be a lot of base. Vets, Hardaway, Bogdanovich, Diallo, Shea Gildas, Alexander. And then we got, getting on to our rookies here, we got Sadiq Bey, KD National Pride, Tyrese Halliburton, base rookie, not bad. I think we got our reactive reds back there. We got Paul Pierce. Here's our reds. Oh, <laughs> Hornet rookie, Vernon Carey Jr., big troll. Um, yeah, we got, and there's a few reds, and there is a green back there. And uh, I kind of peeked. I said I wasn't going to, but I, I cheated. Chris Paul, national pride. Wow. Not a great game seven for Chris Paul, unfortunately. Suns are now out. Darius Garland is our next red. Behind him, we got Rudy Gobert. So we got one more. Al Horford, I think that's it for the reds. We only got one green. Can we get a rook? Ooh, it is a rookie. Come on. Jordan Wara. Hey, nice color match on that. I know he didn't really, uh, he didn't play. Uh, yeah, I think he just played garbage time in game seven um, in their loss to the Celtics, but... I need to check with 502 Frank, see if he needs this one. Jordan Wara, green reactive, not bad. And here's our hobby exclusive inserts. We got Malcolm Brogdon on the montage. Denny Avdia, blue chips. It's another montage. That one's Jamal Murray. We got a, oh man, and that is destroyed this card. Look at all the dents on the cover of that. Another montage. Jeez, D'Angelo Russell. Is there another montage behind D'Angelo Russell? 
It is Men of Mastery, Anthony Davis. Okay, so no huge uh, hobby exclusive inserts. Hoping for straight fire or stained glass. Didn't get any of those, but did get some other cool stuff. Um, let's look through. So here were the Reactive Red exclusives. Did we, I think we got one rookie. Yeah, it was the Vernon Carey, unfortunately. Uh, a lot of other base cards here. I'm not going to go through that huge stack, but our notables in the middle um, did get a lot of... Here's some nice inserts. Wara, Green Reactive. We got a Maxi. Got Edwards. Nice stuff out of Chronicles. I actually do like those Pulsars from Chronicles Draft. Cade, Zaire, and Jalen Green and Mobley. Some nice ones there. And then the big, the big surprise hit. I was not expecting Panini Prism Baseball to give me anything good, but we got a one of one from Robin Yunt. One of one there on the back. Very cool. Completely unexpected. Wanted to do something different today um, and ended up getting something pretty cool out of it. So I hope you guys enjoyed this one. Uh, let me know what you think of this video. Go ahead and drop a like, drop a comment, um, and let me know your thoughts on these Panini Kids crates. If you're thinking of picking one up, let me know. But that's going to do it for today. So thanks for watching, and I'll see you all on the next video.